flow artists when using two props at the same time use the terms timing and direction to refer to the relationships the props have to one another and the visual aesthetic that they create. In short, timing and direction describes the four fundamental ways to spin your props. When spinning two props, the timing refers to the position of the prop at the moment that one passes the bottom of its circle. The two basic timings used are together time and split time. For example, here the poi are spinning and both poi pass an imaginary point on the ground together. This is referred to as together time. In this next example, the poi are spinning and each poi is passing the bottom at different times, offset by 180 degrees. This is called split time. A good analogy is a drummer either hitting a drum at the same time with both hands or hitting the drum alternately. Direction refers to the relative direction that two props have with one another. We are not talking about spinning one prop, which can be seen as clockwise or counterclockwise. We are talking about the relationship of two props Direction. The two basic directions are same and opposite. When both props are spinning the same way, like wheels rolling together, it is called same direction. When both props are spinning opposite directions, it is intuitively called opposite direction. With two timings and two directions, there are four standard timing and direction combinations. Be aware that in advanced patterns, your hands can move in a different timing and direction than your props move in. Remember that the concept of timing and direction assumes a few basic principles in order to accurately describe the spinning relationships. One, there are two spinning objects, not more or less. Two, the objects spin at the same speed. Three, the starting position of the props is either together or 180 degrees opposite. Taking time to practice these patterns without poi can help the learner gain a deeper understanding of these patterns. Timing and direction is a useful concept because it helps spinners of all disciplines learn more quickly and communicate better about their patterns. Learning these timing and directions will greatly improve your spinning.